Hey, it's Ed here. Today, we're taking a look at technical analysis for Bitcoin with Elliott Wave Theory. Couple of advertisements here at the start. I finally completed the Elliott Wave and RSI Advanced course. So if you want to master the RSI and want to learn how it can be utilized properly with Elliott Wave Theory, check out the course on Udemy. I've also founded Candle Trend Capital with these guys over here. So if you are looking for signal service and more education, check us out here on countertrendcapital.com. And lastly, if you want to educate yourself and support me, you can take a look at Patreon, where you can find daily web basics course, access to weekly live streams and extra content overall. Thank you for your support. Let's get into the charts next. So here we are on one hour time frame on Bitcoin chart. And again, today we're going to be focusing on the structures from these highs around 25.3K. Again, uh, I'm not going to go too detail into the previous structures. To me, this was a far away structure that has either ended the wave five over into these highs, or we have created this as the wave one and two of that five. Um, invalidation for that idea is here, very close to it, and this does not seem complete to me. So again, the most or the best idea that I have, or the main idea is that we have the topped uh, the fifth wave up in here. Um, so let's take a look at the more local structures. Uh, this has been presented before. And this invalidation line here is about that wave one uh, of fifth wave. Um, so overall, I do like this being a three-way structure, three waves here, and then looking for another three-way coming down. One to one is exactly at those invalidation levels. And what else we have is uh, the 1.236 has some other nice confluence there, TPOs, naked point of controls, and a daily level right around there as well. Um, Nothing else is really interesting at this to me. Um, I'm still looking for this potential wave B here. We did not really get that fifth wave. So there is again a chance where this is a three-way structure. Since this has been starting to become so long already, if we are comparing even the higher degree wave X here into this smaller time frame, we can see that one to one, meaning that this is the same size already as in this was uh, over here. Uh, a day ago so it is starting to become very much larger which is very not good um, generally we want the smaller time frame degrees to be actually smaller in price and in time in comparison to these higher degree ones so it starts to lose its its good look so again as mentioned there is a chance where instead of a uh, one two three this would be an abc into these lows and even though this extension here is quite large, we could be looking for uh, just a uh, some kind of a instead of ABC, this would become a WXY. Um, I don't, I'm not really too uh, happy about this, but again, this is something that we have to consider since this is taking so long. If we are comparing this as the wave four against this wave two, we can see that the comparison between these two is not really there anymore. Uh, so that's why, again, this is something that we definitely need to be need to be thinking about. But again, that is just one option. The other option is if we want to have more bearish uh, scenario coming down, uh, we talked about this in one of the oh, videos before as well, where we had this as a three wave coming down. Okay, well, we can use these basic same labels, but instead we would have this, instead of W, we would have this as a wave one two, three, and looking for four, and then fifth here. And again, all of these needs to be in three waves. Um, this again would fit the idea of this being a ABC. And again, we have three wave here, a three wave here. And yeah, what we would be seeking is some kind of uh, three wave finishing up in here soon. I don't think it makes any sense to have this as the way four, although that is not yet invalidated. Um, there is a chance, of course, that this could become something like this in wave A, three wave, and then five waves coming down to get that ABC here. But again, it's taking quite a long time. So again, as more time passes on, we can see that the originally we, we had to adjust it based on these pivots because we don't want price to break the trend lines here on the diagonals. But again, as, as the price uh, just a state continuing going sideways, we have to adjust this completely. And soon we are not going to be having a diagonal option anymore at all. So uh, when is that happening? Well, we just use these pivots here. 
if I can get those in, in here. And if we go beyond this parallel channel, uh, there is of course still time um, <laughs> all the way up to um, 11th, Saturday the 11th, yeah, of March. So there is definitely quite a long time still to go, but, but yeah, that is um, the maximum it can go. Until that, then we are still having this as a contracting structure, um, but after that, the wave four is taking too much time. But yeah, these are the two options that I'm keeping uh, a look at. Um, I definitely, I still have the same alerts that we've had uh, since fifth, uh, where we were discussing about this high and and these, I think these lows basically. So we had a potential three here, potential three, and then up. Um, for that fourth maybe now and then that fifth dropping down maybe that is going to happen maybe not we just need to be or at least i'm, I'm watching these highs to be broken before I, I want to be looking for another short setup downwards but i think that's going to do it for this video if you made it this far into the video again i would appreciate the likes and comments if you want more education check out the patreon for the basic course on that on, on Elliott waves and if you want more educated or uh, advanced content check out the course on udemy also if you want signals and more education from multiple people check out ctc candidate trend capital um, where you can find all of these links to on on the description below as well thanks for watching and see you on the next video bye bye